So as the Niners are kicking the tires on Teddy Bridgewater and grooving on the future of River Craycraft and Adam Peters, the Arizona Cardinals go out and sign J.J. Watt. Now, uh, J.J. Watt didn't really play much, didn't play well last year, didn't play much the year before that. The year before that, 2018, had 16 sacks. He's a future Hall of Famer. He's 32 years old, and he's going to be paired now with Chandler Jones, another future Hall of Famer. They're going to have one hell of an edge, uh, edge rush tandem. And think about Watt. He plays on the left side of the defense most of the time. That means he's going to be going up against Mike McGlinchey, who's a hell of a player in his own right. So what do you think about – what this means for the 49ers now that the Cardinals have made a real power move. So this guy can really handle McGlinchey, even though Kyle would make that move again to take McGlinchey. Of course. Well, everyone okay. can handle McGlinchey. I find, this it guy can really handle, yeah. I find it adventurous and imaginative. And I wonder, what are the, are the 49ers hibernating? Well, they got Where River are, Craft. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I see what you're saying. Yeah. Yeah, what do you mean? Yeah. I got Adam Peters. So yeah, I, JJ White, like the 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 Cardinals were eight and eight last year. They have this kind of fresh in a coach, but they have a good roster. The offense ranked sixth out of thirty two teams. The defense ranked thirteenth out of thirty two teams. Now they add JJ Watt. They could have a top ten offense, a top ten defense. Those teams usually make the playoffs. Where does that leave the Niners? The Seahawks haven't fallen off. If they trade Russell Wilson, then they could be an awful team. But they haven't done that yet. The Rams just upgraded big time on offense with Matthew Stafford. The Cardinals upgraded big time on defense with J.J. Watt, and the Niners have River Craycraft. So do you think they're a last-place team right now, or do they, are, they're going to make their move coming up, right? Well, uh, I can't say what they're going to do. Currently, they look to me like the last-place team in the division. Currently. Yes. But, you know, the draft is going to happen, and there's going to be free agency, right? Yes. When is free yes. agency? That's uh, 15th ish, 17th, two oh, weeks. This month? Yeah, two weeks. So, you know, the things are to be determined. I, I'm not going to be uh, critical and negative. Negative. They, they make, they haven't done anything so far, but they may do something. I mean, th th they spend their time in, in that building every day. They must talk about stuff. You know, not ordering out pizza all the time. You know what I mean? So uh, I'm going to say I'm at least open minded. But other teams have certainly been more adventurous and bold so far.